This is an emergency alert. It's the end of the world, and we're all fucked! <laughs> I love this thing. Full disclosure, I didn't think you'd succeed at getting my signal working. So, I was just gonna kill you and take your stuff when you came back? If you came back at all, that is. Guess it'd be a real dick move for me to do that now. Look, I'm what you people would call a raider. Killing, stealing, and cheating is kind of my shtick. And thanks to you, I've got a working radio. So I can reach other like-minded individuals and get them to join me. You've opened the floodgates. Hey, come see me at the top of the world when you get the chance. Oh, I see now. You're here about that guy, huh? Well, good luck getting anything out of him. So, the old bands of raiders each have their own, like, pet projects or whatever. If I'm ever going to rebuild a raider army, I need to figure out which of these crazy tactics actually work. We'll start with my personal favorite, Karma. I'm talking about a chem that hits hard but leaves you reeling. My cutthroat friends figured out a way to weaponize it. I'm gonna lift my old syringe, and you're gonna modify it to shoot carbon darts! <laughs> Just bring it back. We'll find you and kill ya! <laughs> now that you've got yourself some karma, it's time to see it in action! So just make it so there's one less Yahweh to worry about. I know, I know. It sounds crazy to make a beast like that tougher and nastier. But once karma wears off, it'll be as weak as a newborn kitten. That's when you finish it off. Assuming you survived the initial effects. yourself some gross meat covered explosives but now what well use your imagination the trapper sure did let's hear it for brutal efficiency yeah i guess the trappers didn't mind picking shrapnel out of their quarries as cruel as the trappers were the diehards were the exact opposite don't let their name fool you. We caught them that because their stubborn asses refused to give up their dignity and couldn't bear to commit unprovoked violence. Pfft, pacifists. I don't know much about their special tactics. Did they have any? I don't know. Go find a death claw and make friends with it or something. Probably a good time to teach you that not everyone can be your friend out there. That's the real takeaway from the diehards. Moving on, the Blackwater Bandits were known for being sneaky thieves. Let me tell you, they once hit a brotherhood of steel and chaos. <laughs> Insane, right? They snuck right past the guards and stole guns, ammo, mini nukes, you name it! Right out from under the four bastards while the rest of them slept. Next thing you know, the knights moved on out with their tails between their legs, and we had a new arsenal. Well, we still have heavily armed super mutants. Go steal from them. Sneak around. Maybe you won't have to fight them all. But really, all I care about is their gun stash. I'll be keeping an eye on you from up here. I can see just about anything with my robot eyes from these viewfinders. And lucky you, since you helped me tap into the emergency broadcast system, you can hear my lovely voice from anywhere. <laughs> Ooh, what'd you find? A missile launcher? Okay, this one's a little disgusting, but it's ruthless, so I like it. Oh, my stomach turns just thinking about this. 
then again, I haven't been hungry in a while. So who knows how desperate I'll be when I am and there's no more food to eat. Kinda like the gourmands. We called them that instead of what they really were. Cannibals. I'm not gonna make you eat anyone, but let's go through the exercise anyway. I saw a roaming pack of feral ghouls I want you to hunt down. They're always good for target practice anyway. you in on a little secret. My old raider pals left a cache of treasure behind when they all checked out. Problem is, it's locked away and I can't get in there. Double problem, no one trusted each other enough to give anyone complete access to the treasure. I think we're past the point where I just want to use you to further my own goals. I may be starting to like you. Now, I don't want you thinking your pal Rose is going soft on you, so let me just say this. If you ever get it in your head to screw me over, I will gut you with this here saw and string your entrails up like Christmas tinsel. But I was watching you through the viewfinder again and saw you enter the mine. Can you still hear me? Ah, whatever. It's not like you can radio back. Anywho... If I recall, we completely lost track of the Blackwater Bandits back in 96. <sighs> Freddy wasn't looking too good last time we saw her alive. Not her usual bright and spirit itself. Real sick. Her hair looked awful. Something happened in that mine hideout of theirs. Not sure what, but if you can figure it out, I bet you'd be able to track down that key for me. I'll catch up to you when I see you crawl out of that cave. next. They had a camp out near the Devil's Backbone. We never did find out what happened to them. We were spread pretty thin by the time they disappeared. Someone or something probably got to them. Maybe they left a note behind, or some other clue. They were real outdoorsy types, like camping and hunting, so be careful searching the camp for their piece of the key. If it wasn't obvious, they were really into traps. 